Hello, so I titled this video The Worst Disease Known to Man. You might be thinking that's incredibly subjective, and it is well done, but at this moment, right now, it, where I am sitting, it just seems awful, so I wanted to make a video about it. Maybe not the worst disease in the world, but definitely horrific. It's called the filarial worm, or filariasis, and the one I'm talking about today is the one that affects your eyes. It's the worst thing to happen to your eyes since watching that new Fantastic Four movie. Jesus Christ, I had to go to confession after watching that movie. Anyway, the filarial worm is part of a disease called filariasis, which is transmitted into humans through a mosquito bite, and if left untreated, can lead to elephantiasis. Which is where a person's limbs or genitals grow to huge sizes. About 170 million people around the equator have this disease, and while it's not really fatal, it's one of the leading causes of blindness in the world. Uh, I think the main cause of blindness in the world is, is nude beaches filled with old people. Scarring images. So how mosquitoes infect people is they bite someone who has the disease, then they fly about and bite another person who doesn't have the disease and thus transfers some of the larvae from the previous person's blood into their bloodstream. The larvae then migrate to somewhere in the body before becoming adult worms and smashing about wherever they want. Somewhere worm and cozy, nailed it! Sorry again, I'm sorry. It usually takes several bites over a short period to properly infect someone and when they are, the worms inside them live for about five years and produce millions of larvae in their blood. Medicine for this disease often targets the larvae and then the adult worms and while treatment is often successful it doesn't properly repair the tissue damaged or uh, sustained whilst the worms have been living inside your body. Anyway, this has been one of the shortest videos I've, I've, I've really made. I hope you enjoyed it. This is my Snapchat. If you enjoyed it, give it a like. And if you're not already subscribed, you're totally welcome to. My Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook links are down below. I'll see you guys very soon. Goodbye. It was my birthday the other day, September 17th. I turned 20, 20 years old. I do like birthdays. It's a day where everyone has to pretend they care about me and nothing actually really changes on a birthday, you know? Like